What's up, guys? Hey, Smiley, out. Welcome to the Diablo 2 Resurrected Iceman Research Institution. I am your host, Professor Iceman. So, what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to attempt to make a plague. It's going to be the most godly AF bow imaginable. Trust your old dog on this, right? Trust your old dog. And become a channel member or a patron. Links in the description below. And don't forget to like the damn video. And hit the bell. So you get notified for future videos. Yeah, because in which case you will indeed be blessed with many wife. Peace be with you. Those who are looking on. Peace be with ye. Those who pass good word on about the great Ice Dick. Peace with you. And may your enemies be cast. Chum. Shale. Dumbass. Ah, can't have a plague ball. It's fine. Next item. Yep, 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 yep. So I have redeemed myself. That's right. Mi favorita. Bo yet. And yes, it is a rune word. All right, this is greater than faith. This is greater than mist. Of course, that bow's complete ass. This is greater than wind force or eagle horn. It's godly as fuck. Check it out. It's brand. Nice bow. 35% chance to cancel the 14 amplified damage. Windstruck? Are you kidding me? Idiots. Damn! That's fine. That's fine. I'm going to get hit a little bit. No matter. I have Atma's amulet on, so let's see how this goes. 100% chance to cancel the 18 bone spear on striking. Two to bone crossbow skills. Not three. Two for style points. Explosive arrows or bolts, which I'm not going to take advantage of. But it's cool to have one more stat point on the rune word. 355% enhanced damage. Ignore target's defense. A very desirable mod. 20% bonus to attack rating. 330 damage to demons. Hell yeah. 20% deadly strike. Prevent monster heal. Knock back. Knock back. Knock back. Knock back. Knock back. So I don't need knock back. Uh, on the helm any longer. Uh, in which case, I switched out the giant skull with a G face. And let's see what the stats are 35% chance crushing blow, 680% damage to demons. Oh my god! ITD, all this other crap. And I did reach the 75% IS breakpoint. Uh, I didn't have the proper gear to reach the final breakpoint with the GMB ball. Let me show you what that is. Welcome to the Iceman Diablo. Research institution. May peace be upon you. Uh, so 142, I could have 3.57 attacks per second. So with 75 IS, which includes the IS and the bow, uh, which this bow has none. Is this the wrong bow? Shit, there's a bow called Wrath too, isn't there? That's what I meant to showcase. It's fine. This one's godly. Let's see what it can do. Um, so this boat sucks, man. Are you kidding me? What an ass. Are you kidding me? It takes a jaw and a low root? Oh my god. Let's... Okay, so... Oh, wow. So the damage really sucks. But let's take a look-see. Let's try some multi shot. Oh my god! Look at the bone spares! Holy frick. Holy shit. Um, the bow spears, they probably don't do ass for damage. Do they? Some damn damage going on. Level 18 bone spear. What damage does that do even? I'm gonna look it up. Oh my god, I'm destroying in the Black Marsh. This bow's great for the Black Marsh. Look at this. And I'll show you the rest of the gear. Guided arrow. Oh my god. It really is a 100% chance. Okay. 
Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, and it should only apply... Watch this. It's not going to apply to the external arrows. See that? See that? It's not applying to those. The ones on the way on the outside. You got to get them... I think it's the center, too. Holy shit. Let's get that Valkyrie up. He, He's going to help. He's a big help. Um... I need to try, I need to try better area, but let's see how much damage that Bone Spear does. I, so a level 18 Bone Spear does 179 to 190 magic damage. Of course, the enemies don't resist magic much in general, but still that damage is complete ass. But that's fine, it adds up, and it does pierce enemies for that matter. So let's check out the Frigid Highland, shall we? But first off, let me show you the gear. Same gear as my last video, trying to keep shit consistent for the research institution, sometimes. Laying of hands, mantled heel, godly ring, maxed out, things worth like a J rune or something. Nas coil, uh, no need for that, yes, but I did need some life leech and I didn't feel like getting some dual leech ring or whatever. Budget, man, this is kind of budget. Uh, Raven Frost, not perfect. Elder's Boots, all right. This is budget. I don't want to use War Travs. I want to use. I could use Go Riders, but I like the. I like running fast as a freaking toad. Atmos Amulet, uh, just to add a little bit more. And yeah, it will override the higher level amp from the bow, but let's be honest, this shit is never gonna cast, so it doesn't matter anyway. Five percent chance to cast level two amp damage on striking. G Faith. Uh, with IS, fast rate recovery, and all that other crap, and I put a plain IS jewel in it. That's where that IS is coming from, with no other mod. And treachery, all right? And I don't have a torch. I don't have an any. My damage is complete ass. That's fine. Let's see how well he does in the Frigid Highlands. Check out my other channel, if you will, Spiritual Journeys with the Iceman, linked in the description below. I have been playing some Build of Warcraft, so if any guys have any interest in watching the World of Warcraft videos, check that out if you want. I'm trying to get that shit monetized so I can keep playing it. I don't want to keep playing that shit if I can't get it monetized, but I need a thousand subs, so hook your old dog up, if you will. Go over there, give me a subscription, and I'd appreciate it, brah. Well, let me in the comments. You guys been playing Diablo? Isn't that, isn't the lottery center some shit? Isn't the lottery center some shit? Is that this week? Okay, so today is October 2, and I'm posting this video tomorrow. Um, isn't that next week or some shit and they have like all that bullshit added to it? They have the uh, those things that like break the game. They have those Sunder Charms. And don't they have something else? Oh, the Terror Zones. Uh, that some argue break the game as well, but let me know what is your opinion. Uh, on the plus side, at least it gives us incentive to run areas that we normally wouldn't run, you know? So at least there's that. But let me know your opinion in the comments below. Let me try chaos with this guy. With this guy. <laughs> Oops, almost got it wrong. Let me try chaos with this guy. So check this out. The fade has procced, so I have a fire res of 50, but my other res still suck, except for poison, fortunately, which I need some poison res. Let's see how well this bow fares. I mean, what so... Who the hell would make this bow is my question. If you have a jaw rune and a low rune, does it like a kick assassin or something wear this just to look cool sometimes? Cast bone spear in every kick. Would you make this over even mist for that matter? Let me know in the comments. I mean, you, you wouldn't want to do that, but charm rune is a very high rune. And if mist were actually good, it would be a desirable rune, which would vastly increase its value. Uh, in which case, Mist would be more valuable and hard to get than a Faith Bow. But that's just not the case because Mist really sucks, uh, according to my testing. But who would make this? My God! Mist is even better than this! And this thing is still more expensive. Uh, in, the, in the current economic iteration, anyway. Alright, so let's see, let's see him do Chaos. Don't die. Don't die, Ice Boy. A little bit of strength. 
This bow sucks! God damn! What the hell? I mean, at least I had some ITD. So my, I, look at this, the uh, attack rating, 83% chance to hit the Doom Knights, 81% chance with multi-shot, which I'm primary use, primarily using. How much do I pierce? Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, it's actually, it's quite nice when you cast amp damage, and having ITD really helps with that, with the trash mobs. Getting that, uh, just hitting every time, it's a big deal. It's a pretty big deal. Uh, the bones on, I mean, without faith, the problem is, it's hard to really get your IS up there. And this guy, I even put 14 points in his, or 15 points in his penetrate, you see that? And you, you guys, you know that he loves to penetrate. All right, that's like his forte. He loves to penetrate, but even with that, even with the fact of reality that he loves that penetration shit, and he put 15 points in there out of 20, his attack rating still sucks. And I put something here to see what the pierce says. The pierce says deadly strike, crushing blow damage to demons. Where's the pierce? <laughs> Are you kidding me? The fuck is the pierce? Am I piercing? Uh, okay, I don't see the pierce. I don't know why I don't see the pierce on here. <laughs> is it just because it's from a skill? Does your skill not show up? All right, nonetheless, I have a 79% chance to pierce. I thought it would show up on there. Maybe it doesn't. Uh, that must just be from your gear, those stats. Uh, in some instances. Uh, I know your res aren't just from your gear. Your res are from, like, the stat quest that you get. That, that adds to the, the character sheet here. Although... It doesn't show res on here. Alright, that's fine. So the bow works. I mean, even with shitty gear, but... Who the hell made this? I guess the bone spear thing's kind of cool. If you were to hit the max breakpoint, you'd be casting more of them, obviously. I mean, maybe it'd be fun to try, like, a strafe build with max IS on a, uh, maybe like a great bow or something. Uh, something that you can achieve higher breakpoints. Actually, it'd probably be a matriarchal bow. Make this thing in a matriarchal bow have uh, uh try to achieve the fastest highest breakpoint but i mean it's really you, you can't really compete with faith with things like this at all and this is even more expensive faith is a jaw and an ohm whereas this is a jaw and a low and a gull uh, low being more expensive than an ohm as it is So, this is like a niche bow or some shit? Is this niche? Nichey, itchy, itchy, nichey, nichey, itchy? Is that how you say it? Niche. N I T C H. Nichey, the nichey, nichey, itchy bow. Uh, I think is what this thing is. You could put it on an assassin. I wonder how he would do with it. Uh, he would, uh,. I, I'd be curious to see how how well he can kick with the uh, with the brand bow. 100% chance of uh, of the thing casting. Yeah, I mean maybe maybe I'll put on a Sansom. It's still gonna suck dick, but maybe I'll give it a shot. Am damage. So what I need to try is Wrath, which I believe has. Because I have a lot of demon damage, and it has uh, Decrepify on striking, I hope. Jeez, what's with this being hit thing? What's with this cast on hit thing? Uh, when you're an archer, you don't want to get hit. They might have forgot about that. You don't really want to get hit when you're an archer. Of course, if you're a kick assassin, at least you're going to be up in their grill, so you will be getting hit more. Not that they're the most durable of classes, they're probably far from it. Uh, maybe you could put max DR, put a freaking Leviathan on it. Just get style points. 
just do it for style point reasons. Get a Leviathan and a couple other things. Get that 50% uh, cap DR. Let's see how well it slays Satan. Make that portal. Pretty bad. That's fine. Actually, with the end of damage, it's great. Look at that! Oh my god! Shit has zeal on it. If only I could equip it. I'd probably kick it ass then. But anyway. <clears throat> uh, if you guys would like the video, let me know what you think about this bow. What the hell is this like for? Why would you use this? Did you put it on a mercenary or something? Uh, if you put it on a mercenary, at least they'll be getting hit maybe a little bit more and be casting the damn damage, which would be kind of nice. But I mean, it's hard to pass up an Act 2 mercenary where you have the Might Aura already embedded and you can couple that with the concentration level 20 at that from Pride. Uh, yeah, you could put the Mist on the, ch the, <laughs> on the guy, but uh, it's going to suck. So... For style points. The bow's for style points. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace be with you. It's the best bow for style points, alright? Hell yeah.